In this video, we will learn how we can detect planes in scene form and how we can automatically place objects when the plane is detected. So let's quickly set up the project, add scene form dependency, add Java 8 support, hit sync now. Go to the manifests file and add camera permission, declare feature camera and add metadata, go to activity main.xml file and add a fragment, set width and height to match parent, give this an id ar fragment and name, go to main activity.java file, create an object of ar fragment class and refer this to the ar fragment in our activity main.xml file cast this to AR fragment set the scene of this AR fragment on a update listener this on update press alt enter and create this method so every time the scene is updated we will get the frame from the AR scene view by calling AR fragment, get AR scene view, get AR frame. Create a collection of plane class and we will store all the updated trackables of plane class from the frame. We will go through each of this plane. And we will check if the plane is getting tracked then we will create an anchor on top of it and we will come out of this for each loop to so first create the anchor in the center of this plane plane dot create anchor plane dot get center pose this will create the anchor in the center of our plane now that we have the anchor, we can create a cube and show that cube on that anchor. Make cube and pass the anchor as its parameter. Press Alt Enter and create this method. Create the material dot make opaque with color. Context this new color. Color will be let's say red and then we can accept the material and then we can create our renderable cube renderable equals shape factory dot make cube size will be 0.3f on the x-axis 0.3f on the y-axis and 0.3f on the Z axis. Center will be new vector 3, 0f on the x axis, 0.3f on the y axis, and 0f on the z axis. And the last parameter is the material. So this material will be applied on this cube. Now that we have our cube renderable, we can create an anchor node. New anchor node on the given anchor and set the renderable of this anchor node to the cube renderable that we created and then add this anchor node to our scene ok create a boolean variable private boolean is model placed equals false and here set is model placed to true and in the on update method check for the condition if model is placed if the model is placed then we will return from this method okay so now we can run and test our app okay so let's test our app search for a plane our plane has been detected and the cube has been rendered automatically